Hi, this is Sam. Get Cape, where Cape fly. Kind of had a bit of a strange festival life, really, because it's gone from one extreme to the other. Glastonbury two years ago was very, uh, very rained out and very kind of you know, pretty. I mean, it was good, but it was kind of the most extreme Glastonbury in recent memory from a lot of. Uh, Hard and festival goers, so thrown at the deep end. Um, in terms of playing, Reading last year was mad, kind of the first major festival that we did. So, really quite exciting to be uh, you know, playing on the same stages that you know, some of your heroes have been playing on before. Best band I've ever seen at a festival, um, probably the Flaming Lips at the Wireless Festival last year, just sun was out, Hyde Park. Just kind of amazing atmosphere and just the lips kind of tore the place to bits as they always do. My laptop blew up at Truck Festival last year so literally uh, we were doing the sound check and the laptop blew up. I had to do the whole thing solo and as soon as I started playing it absolutely pelted it down. So a solo on the main stage of a quite big festival with no laptop in the pouring rain but you know it kind of it kind of worked out in the end, but yeah, it wasn't a it wasn't a standard get a cape set anyway. It's bizarre when you when you think about the fact that there's been so many amazing gigs that you wish you were at, and that you know it's very uh, very difficult to pick one. I'd love to have seen out the driving at the Astoria. I've seen uh, videos of that; it looks incredible. The quite like to have been in Victoria Park as well for the. Rock Against Racism because you kind of see videos of it and you hear stories from other people. It would have been amazing to kind of experience it firsthand. Well, I guess I'd also like to have been a Flaming Lips and the White Stripes New Year's Eve two years ago would have been amazing as well. well I'm still here.